Welcome back, everyone, uh, to Sly Cooper and the Thievius Raccoonus. And right now, we're going to go ahead and fire off some firecrackers. I do love so me some crackers. Especially the Ritz. I, I love Ritz crackers. They're, they're pretty good. Hey, hey. All right. Now that done and over with, let's head on down. Whoa. Whoa. Right. Whoa. What the? I calculated the trajectory of these rockets, and I'm 99% sure you'll be able to ride them all the way to the top of that statue before they explode. Hmm. What about that other 1%? Well, in that case, Sly, you will be blown to bits. But the experience will no doubt be spectacular. Nice. Now, to unlock these rockets, you're going to need all seven of the Panda King's treasure keys. Right on. I'll steal them in no time. All right. Uh, so we got there's that over there, but we also got one, two, and I think the third one over here. Uh, let's go ahead and just go up this way. Actually, hold on. I actually really hope he didn't see me there. Oh. Okay. Uh, I guess don't use the decoy for anything. Oh, hello. Another one of these. <clears throat> Alright then. Alright, well, I don't know what Ben just said. I think he said something to to along the lines of this vehicle is a lot is more similar is is or is very similar to the one in Miss Ruby's uh, hideout. There we go. Though I don't think like unlike the uh, the other ones. I forget what I was going to talk about. Oh well. Uh, uh, let's see. There was. Oh yeah, like I think I think I was going to say something like the lines of, uh, this this one isn't really that difficult compared to the one in in uh, the the bayou. Back a bit. Back too much. There we go. All right. I'm surprised that something this dangerous can actually be inside the fireworks facility. Like seriously, man. Away with you. Actually, now that I think about it, there's actually one more. There's actually one level that I actually have a, a pretty big distaste for, and it's it's. Uh, oh, we'll we'll get to it. You know, but I have no idea which. Oh shoot. Okay, I took I took him out. Good, 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 good. 
that man the vi the video cut out <laughs> the video on the TV just freaking cut out when uh, when I was like taking care of these uh, enemies I had no idea if I even survived it it's just uh, man just can't believe that actually happened all right there we go. Now then. Uh, there's also this elevator right here that you can, you can take. Uh, you no, know, it's just sidestep elevator. Pretty interesting stuff, all things considered. But, uh, oh. Did you just see that? Because I did. I believe it's over here. Is this it? No, this is not it. Duel by the dragon. Hold on. Actually, I actually want to do this. A desperate race. Hey, we got another car level. Another racing one. I think this one's either easier. Or they're they're way more difficult. Yeah. It's the same as before. It's the same, the same thing as the uh, the race in Utah, but now uh, in, in here. And I think there's like ice physics here too. Yeah. Yeah, the ice might be a little more slippery. Dang it. I was actually really close, too. Oh, man. Okay. Let's go. Oh, that guy messed up. either. Oh yeah, there's definitely ice physics here. Do your best to drive on the snow. And, uh, you know, you'll, you'll win eventually. That to save my skin. Ok, 
Okay. First one was definitely a lot harder. So yeah, you just have to make as many... You just have to get, like, a bunch of uh, straight lines in this race because, you know, physics and all that. But yeah, that was actually pretty short. Um, got 11 minutes on here, uh, which is a bit too short for my liking. So, I, I, you know what, I'm just going to go ahead and do the third level and save the boss fights for last. Or maybe I can fit the boss fight into this one because... From what I remember, the boss fight itself is actually pretty simple. Okay. So. What I'm going to do is that I'm just gonna, you know, uh. I'm probably gonna try and fit the, uh. the, the boss in this part. So that. Uh. There's, there's less of a weird disconnect when it comes to the when it comes to like uh formatting these videos because i am breaking the two levels uh part uh thing the two levels a uh two levels apart uh you know and that that includes the uh that includes the um the boss fight as well i don't know what you're doing here in china Owns this place. You must only have eyes for me if you're too blind to see what's going on around here. All I see is a pathetic <clears throat> who's escaped justice for far too long. I'm proud to be a thief, especially when I'm stealing from a vicious extortionist like the Panda King. Open your eyes, detective. These quaint temples are a front for an illegal explosives factory. Don't try okay. to Okay. You criminals are all the same, and none of you can escape justice. Alright. Level begin. here get these right here so yeah this is the second Carmelia level like this uh, yeah oh dope okay oh, okay uh, go down here swipe these and on top here. Ba boom. Easy pickings. Nope. Okay. Maybe not that easy pickings. Oh yeah. I think I, I think I am on top of things here. There are forty freaking forty of these freaking uh clue bottles. And ooh, whoa, there's that's a gap. And currently, I'm not even sure where the heck everything is at the moment. And I think I feel like I missed something. Maybe uh, I don't know. I'm not sure. But boom. Get some in the hot springs. At least I think they're hot springs. I'm not even sure. Okay, nothing there. Okay. 
Really wish the camera didn't pan this way. There we go. A lot of double backs. Unwinding. Oop, lobbing. Whoa, what? Five away. So I'm hoping that the five is actually right here. So I'm hoping. Watch your back, Cooper. When you least expect it, I'll be there. Okay, goodbye, Carmelita. Blueprints, actually. Some in, there are some in the be frickin' beginning. Actually, not sure. Can, can wait, not hold on. Get get out of the map. Can I actually go back there? So I'm gonna try and go go all the way back. Make an attempt. Or you know what? No. Just exit the level. Just exit the level. And head back in. That way you don't have to waste so much time. Okay, so... Ouch, freaking... Ugh. Oh, they're on that first island. Freeze, raccoon. How can I freeze? Okay, I'm yeah, yeah. Scary. Whatever. Shut up, Ringtail. I don't know what you're doing here in China, but I'm sure it can't be good for whoever owns this place. You must only have eyes for me if you're too blind to see what's going on around here. All I see is a pathetic thief who's escaped justice for far too long. I'm proud to be a thief. Especially when I'm stealing from a vicious extortionist like the Panda King. Open your eyes, detective. These quaint temples are a front for an illegal explosives factory. Don't try to confuse the issue. You criminals are all the same, and none of you can escape justice. Ah, okay. I miss these in the beginning. There's... The remainder should be over here. In fact, uh, let me just, is this going to protect me? No. Is this going to protect me? Yes. Okay. So, okay, the remaining is right over there. Yeah. Off to the side right here. There we go. Now I have enough. Time to press forward. Actually, I, can, I think I can just go over here. Swipe these around. Unfortunately, this vault code appears to have been written in owl dialect. I won't be able to crack the code until we meet and defeat the bird who created it. Seriously? Wow. What a stupid way. Oh man, this is kind of stupid. Not gonna lie. Alright, there we go. Goodbye again, Carmelita. Let's take that. So yeah, uh, we can't fight, we can't uh, get that last page until uh, until like we defeat the final, final boss or something. I don't know. 
I guess I, I guess that's a spoiler. Not I wasn't much in, into like keeping things secret, especially for a game that's been around for like what twenty some years. So yeah, I, I think um, I think this is like fine enough. Like I don't know. I don't I don't think it's gonna be that bad. Okay, there we go. I had to whack it first before uh hook before hooking on. I see you carrying cane of notorious Cooper Thief clan. Have you come here for revenge? To steal back the previous Vacunas? That was my plan at first, but now I'm more interested in putting an end to your avalanche extortion racket. Why should you care? If I bury a few worthless village in snow, you are a thief, just like me. No, that's only half right. I am a thief from a long line of master thieves, while you, you're just a frustrated firework artist turned homicidal pyromaniac. Insolent child. You shall pay dearly for your disrespect. Still, to honor your Cooper ancestry, I will send you to your doom. With the beauty of my new firework technique, Flame Fu. Alright, so he'll throw, he'll constantly throw uh, projectiles at you until you get, get really close. You know, do the whole namaste thing. But all you gotta do is just approach him, whack him, a whack him a bunch, and uh, yeah, that's pretty much the fight. Eventually he'll, he'll toss you uh, forward you'll he'll uh he'll toss you forward uh, at which point you gotta just repeat the process a key to, to knowing what to do is to check out his uh, movements when he is uh, when you're up close because he has some very telegraphed uh, attacks. So basically, uh, the palms of thunder. You stay still where you are. Mo mooning chop, or oh, oh dear, I died. <laughs> mooning chop. Uh, you gotta move to the side, and fiery wheel. You just gotta, you gotta jump, and that's pretty much it. You know, you just gotta keep doing that until all's all's well that ends well, I suppose. And of course, you know, uh, I am surprised that I've actually died to this guy twice. Yeah, you just gotta keep, you gotta have it like, wa your turns wide enough for the, for the projectiles to not hit you. But yeah, his health goes down pretty slowly. So. This boss fight is actually pretty easy. Uh, all, you gotta, all you gotta do is just get yourself into a sort of rhythm with this guy. And uh, yeah, that's pretty much it. Retrieving the Panda King section of the Thievius Raccoonus gave me a chance to learn about my technically minded ancestor, Otto Van Cooper. Not known for his physical dexterity, Otto relied on vehicles to aid him in his criminal endeavors. 
Armed with his designs, I was sure Murray would be able to make some cool modifications to the team van. A frustrated Inspector Fox, having missed me coming down the mountain, threw the Panda King in jail, thus putting an end to his avalanche protection services and ensuring the safety of mountain villages throughout China. My gang and I took a little time off and did some shopping in Hong Kong. Thoroughly relaxed, we headed home to plan our next move. All right. And that is the last. Okay, partner. This is that is the last episode. This is last uh, mission. Or no. Wait. <laughs> That's the last moments of this part. I should say. Murray is by B Bentley having a hot dog, reading some stuff, probably. And so, yeah. Uh, thank you all for watching. And I'll be seeing you guys next time for the final f the boss, which will probably be recorded in one part in one, or one take. Uh. Probably, depending on how how easy it is, which I don't think it is. But yeah, we're like uh, the final stretch of the game. So yeah, see you guys next part.